Hi, I'm Jacob Anoldi, and this is a video abstract of my forthcoming article in TCS called Computer Algorithms, Market Manipulation, and the Institutionalization of High Frequency Trading. The article is describing the use of uh, automated trading, the use of uh, executing algorithms in financial markets, that's sometimes also referred to as high frequency trading. Uh, estimate says that roughly speaking half of all trades today are executed automatically by computers, by algorithms. The article describes three cases of market manipulation. The peculiar thing however about those three cases is that it involves algos not as uh, the perpetrators but as victims of manipulation. So all three cases are about human traders taking positions in the market, um, actually placing limit orders, um, which uh, triggers responses from algos that are in the interest of their human counterparts. In two of the three cases described in the article, this led financial regulators to step in and penalize um, the human traders for market manipulation. That the article argues signifies quite a shift in the uh, in financial regulation because all three attempts to manipulate were really so transparent, so easy to see through that they wouldn't fool any humans and therefore arguably five or ten years ago they would not have been in any way uh, deemed uh, illegal. So we are actually looking at instances of uh, or examples of a bit of, sh of, of a shift in the way that financial uh, regulatory code is being interpreted. This shift has the uh, purpose of protecting this new financial practice. So we are looking at an example of how this new and this is becoming quite a significant part of the financial industry, uh, namely uh, the use of algorithms, how that practice needs some kind of institutional uh, protection. And that is, in a nutshell, the, uh, the argument of the article. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you.